Oh, well, in the last video, uh, we were we were uh, trying to write in driver from you know from a user programs perspective. So the GUI or uh, the graphics user interface, the main program, you know, would be in in a need of knowing some of the values of of the registers. And uh, so the requirement is that we got to be knowing the analog output value registers value, which is which is uh, typically called an uh, holding register inside our Modbus uh, linguistics. So we need to know the the values of the memory locations starting from 40108 to 40. 110 and and the device we are trying to uh, read from is device number 17 these values are in in uh, decimal number system okay and the moment we you, you see the memory address to be f starting from 404 that means you know that these are holding registers and the function code for uh, holding registers reading holding registers uh, is is uh, 03 so uh, to, to, to make that request packet to make that uh, 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 set of byte array that we will be sending to the device to the to the PLC or to the slave device is is, is uh, should should comply with uh, this thing where is my modbus protocol guide where is where is uh, where is that function code where is that uh, zero three mm -hmm. where is zero three function yeah so th this is what we have to implement inside our uh, our, our software yep so the query the the protocol is asking for uh, for uh, this the the query to be written like this so the first byte has to be the slave address okay let's go back okay what is the slave address it is 17 and when you when you calculate when you 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 convert uh, 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 17 to hex value it turns out to be 11 okay so decimal seven, 17 uh, hex is is 11 yeah so come here the first byte has to be the slave address and that that has to be 11 and then the function code yeah we know that this this has a reading holding registers is is function code 03 so the second byte up here has to be 03 i mean 03 in decimal is same as 03 in hex yeah so 03 now it is asking for uh, the protocol is asking from the starting address is asking for the starting address and the first byte has to come you know up here so high byte most significant byte of the starting address has to be first and then then the lower byte has to be you know punched in so let's take what address are we looking for we are looking the starting address is 40108 right so let's go here da, 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 da. let's paste it and we know that these numbers are offset right and what was the number offset holding registers are offset by these numbers 4 3 times 0 1 so let us deduct that number where is minus who what did he do come on 40108 minus 4001 that turns out to be 107 this is in decimal right so 
when you are sending starting address you are not sending the starting address absolute starting address yeah you are sending the offset you are sending the extra value which is which is over 4 you know 4 3 times 0 1 so this is the value this is the offset value okay and once you convert this offset value to 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 to, to hex it's 6b okay so you see that it is 6b but you have to have the high byte first and 6b has to be accommodated inside you know two bytes yeah so the higher byte of 6b is of course 00, zero right so 00, zero up here and then comes 6b higher byte most significant byte comes first and then the lower significant bytes so this is how it's organized and then then the protocol asks for you know number of points I mean how many register you really want to be reading yeah but we have to read from 108 till 11 like 110 right so that it's three registers so again I mean here we have to write three and again high by actually it's a two byte location you can write okay so three becomes zero zero and then zero three you understand that yeah right and then after that once so now we've got these numbers yeah and after that we take these numbers and then we calculate we, we plug in zeros here so so actually uh, this has to be like this uh -huh. and we plug zero zero here right two times okay and then we calculate CRC over over entire this value not over this value I mean, this this is a mistake usually people make you don't have to calculate CRC of this instead you have to calculate the CRC of this okay so once you calculate the CRC or CRC 16 of this this is the number you're gonna get okay actually you'll get uh, 8764 but lower uh, 76 but the lower byte has to be written first so then then you write it like that okay how CRC 16 is calculated let's park it for a while let's just not talk about it for a moment yeah so this is how, how it, it turns out to be 11 device 03 function number 006b because I wanted to send the offset address of, of that uh, holding register and it turns out to be 108 in in decimal 006b but I've got you know two bytes location it has to be accommodated inside two bytes so 006b we are adding you know 0, 0 before it and then again I want to be using three memory locations again I've got two bytes so 0, 0 this is 3 and this is you know adding 0, 0 on the left and then like I said here we make all this packet and then over this we calculate CRC 16 CRC 16 would have come to be higher by to be 87 and lower by to be 76 in in in, in uh, hex so lower byte is is written like that you see that ah, they're not mentioned here but we know that I mean lower byte has to come first and then higher byte has to has to be written well so this is what it actually is and this is the packet in fact this is the packet what you will have to write over the serial port so let me just make it red so in short if you want to get analog output values of the registers 40108, 109 and 1010 from the device ID 17, this is what you have to write in the software to the serial port. So electronically this line means this. So this is this is our for a common people and then this is the electronic representation of what what this English you know thing or, or whatever English 
thing we are trying to accomplish. 